Hi Mary, so today I start a new job. I'm nervous, but only because I think it's going to be rubbish. Uh, the interview process was apply for the job, watch a presentation online about what I'll be selling. Then they said I'd have a telephone interview. And my telephone interview comprised of one question, which was, can you commit to 20 hours a week? And I said yes, and that was it. And then I watched a training video at home. So it's like they're trying to stop you from actually seeing where you're going to work and the atmosphere of where you're going to work before you start. And what I've read online about this company, about what they sell, is not great. But it's a job for the next six weeks. So wish me luck. So I have a new record of time spent at a job. One hour. Congratulations. That was the biggest load of nope I have ever come across. Ugh. Now the problem is, I'm trying to be a more ethical person. And that was possibly one of the least ethical jobs I've ever come across. So you're cold calling people who have apparently asked for information, but half of them didn't even know who the company was. And you know as well as I do, that this is the kind of company that would buy information from other companies. So when you tick a box saying you're happy for is to pass on your details to third parties, this is one of those third parties. After doing a bit of Googling myself about the company, that the company makes the bulk of its money by selling the uh, trial membership, which is for four weeks, it's one pound bargain, you think. But then they hope that people forget to cancel the direct debit. And then four weeks later, 98 pounds left your account. And I think that's how they make their money. Maniacal lad. <laughs> Maniacal laugh. <laughs> Maniacal laugh. <laughs> Maniacal laugh. <laughs> Maniacal laugh. <laughs> I'd much rather do anything else, anything else, than spend my day annoying people, which is basically what cold calling is. Pretty much using your the sales pitch to trick people into paying now. It's just pound, just pay now. I mean, we've all been there with really strong sales pitches and the psychology of it just makes you go, oh my God, yes, okay, yes, I've fallen in that trap before. But I couldn't believe it, like I'd gone behind the veil and seen what these people are doing and it's not ethical. But the first thing they did, which they didn't tell me, they said that today was my starting date and the first thing they did was hand me a piece of paper saying that um, I accept that I won't get paid for today because today is my trial. Like a trial membership, I suppose. Today is my trial and they can choose whether or not to give me a job or not. They wanted me to go on the phones and they wanted me to sell. So even if I did sell, anything I sold today, I wouldn't get commission on. And then they could quite frankly not have me back. They take in new staff every Monday and Wednesday, they told me. They're constantly looking for people. So I left within an hour. I was like, I'm so sorry. It's not for me. Went to see my friend instead. Had fun. Whatever. Not not necessarily a wasted day. Glad I went. Otherwise it'd be like, oh, what if? I just can't do that kind of unethical bullshit. Bullshit. 